Head it out. I'm out. Excuse me. Good to see you. Good to see you. Hey. <laughs> Good to see you. What? You have a nice year. <laughs> see hey, we'll see you in November. Yeah, he's the little saw colt eating on the hay bale over there. Is it a little yearling? Uh, yeah, it's a little yearling at 138. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Thanks. Oh, shoot, yeah, I see it. Yeah, I got a Yeah, there he is. Yeah, I got a buddy with a record sell Maybe. for ninety thousand dollars? Maybe I think so. Wow, wow. Now what was really special about that horse that it would have brought such a, a large price? I think just two people that really wanted he was a super gentle horse. He'd fit anybody. Somebody could really enjoy him. And it just happened to catch the two two people that really wanted him just competitive bidding. I understand. Well, uh, now is it intended to be a ranch horse, a performance horse? Because normally I wouldn't think that you could make your money back on well, a ranch. No, really I think it's just for a retired lady that's got a, some cows, wants to enjoy just riding a quiet gillin, enjoy herself. I understand. Uh, that's mainly it, I think. Right. And, uh, you know, just somebody that can afford something, do something like that, and enjoy it. Yes, sir. Well, that was more or less uh, the gelding mentioned in there. Kind of took another question away. <laughs> <laughs> you know, as far as uh, trying to make anybody back on the horse. But I can understand that uh, if the woman who purchased it is familiar with the horse already, then... Uh, well, I don't... I, I mean, I think she just showed up today. She's probably maybe been seen in, in the catalog. I and, understand. Uh, trying to find something that she wanted. And she likes this sale. Uh, it probably meant something to her just to come to buy something here and knowingly that it's probably something that would fit her. I understand. Well, thank you very much for taking a little bit of time out of your very busy day. Yes, sir. To uh, talk a little bit about that record selling horse, <laughs> as far as I know. Okay. <laughs> Thanks.
<laughs> okay. Congratulations. Thank you. Another sale for the pitchfork. So, whatever pitchfork fork says, I'm sure you can believe it, right? You're sure? Gave sure, very exactly. Yeah, so. so, how did everything go, do you think? How, what was your this experience is like? This is a wonderful place, I think. I've, it's been six years since I've been back. Oh, okay. And my husband was alive then. He's not now, so anyway. Right. I'm getting by okay. I just breathe really, really hard with this Parkinson's. But anyway, he looks like a really nice horse. I see. A very kind eye. Do you feel like you wound up with what you were looking for? No, I didn't. I, but I was planning on getting a weanling or yearling, and I'd have to spend two years training them at least. Right, you know, so right. This guy's barking, I think, at 14 years of age. Right. And he's got a lot of good years left him. Okay. I think he'll do just fine. So you were looking for a ranch horse then? It, yeah, and okay. I have one gelding at home that's extremely lonely, and so I think this will solve, solve the problem. I so, see. Sure. Okay. And now how far are you going to have to trailer him before you get home? Three and a half hours. Okay, well that's about my, the same distance. I'm out of Amarillo. Oh, really? Okay. Yes. I'm in Chickasha, Oklahoma. Okay. Well. <laughs> hey, there's a heart trailer. That's my real from Chickasha. I mean, not people pick up the people. Oh, yeah. Make the trailer. Wow. Chickasha, Oklahoma. All right. Well, I want to hold you up. Thank you very much for sharing you your so experience. Much. You guys are wonderful. I bet you're ready to get into some air conditioning. Oh, no joke. How do you guys feel about your purchase? We're I'm pretty excited. confident, yeah. All right, did you do some research before you actually came, uh, yes, get the catalog ahead of time and look over all the offerings? And yes, sir. We watched the catalog and Facebook videos. Ah. Uh, came to demonstration yesterday. Okay, right. Small day yesterday. Right. Uh, had a whole lot of discussions and debate over which ones we we liked and which ones would perform the best. Right, right. So you had several that uh, were potential. Did the uh, bidding process kind of weed some of your picks out? Uh, well, we really decided uh, before which ones were going to go the highest. Okay. And then we decided we didn't. We weren't going to be prepared for that. Right. So um, we decided we're getting a couple two-year-olds. Okay. Um, two-year-olds are going to be a little bit cheaper because they're not seasoned. Right. And then you can take them and train them. Exactly. Uh, the way you want them to be trained. Right. Now, so, are they going to be wind up being ranch horses, roping horses? Uh, well, we, we run cows, and so we work cattle on gotcha. horseback. Gotcha. Um, they'll end up doing that a little bit, and we're trying to make some versatility horses out of them. Okay. So we can show a little bit on the side. Okay. So we got a horse trailer here today. We're going to right. uh, transport them long distances that way. But when we're running cows and stuff, we like use that half top trailer that right. all these guys are Right. Using. Well, it kind of makes sense to, uh, to start with a younger horse and train it to your likings, is it not? Yes, sir. That way you don't pick up any habits they've learned from someone else. Well, right. We hold that nice. Um, you can really easy that way and there's some of these horses they sell high dollar and they're really seasoned and yeah. you really don't have to do anything to those right um and there's some of them we bought some before that have bad habits they'll kick at you mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. don't like to be shooed and that sort of right thing. so it right. makes it a little bit harder that way right but okay well don't let me hold you up no no you're um, fine <laughs> if you can walk and talk at the same time that's fine too yeah i'm, I'm not as, as good at that so. now you guys are brothers is that right yes, sir. okay yes, sir, yeah three years apart Okay, so when you get them loaded up on the trailer, how long are they going to have to ride before uh, get to where they're going to go? A couple of hours. A couple of hours? Yeah. Okay. So, so you're from Oklahoma, Texas? We're here in Texas. Yeah. Okay. From Alito. Okay. All right. So I presume you don't have a uh, uh, horse program of your own on the ranch? Uh, well, we work on them, but, you know, it's getting something from Jeff Williams is nice. So. I understand, okay. <laughs> I understand that. And getting a horse this young, you're going to have an awful lot of years to 
work with them. Yes, sir. Well, that's one of the, the good things about buying a two-year-old horse. Right. Uh, people like to buy younger horses, especially if this is, he's only had 90 days on him, so three months. Right. Um, yes, thank you all very much. Um, so, you have a, a younger horse, you get them trained the way you want them, and then you can ride them a long time. Uh, a lot of these ranches like to sell horse about eight, seven, eight-ish. Mm -hmm. um, and if they really want to hang on to one, they'll hang on nine or ten, and then get rid of them because that, those are their prime years. Yes. And they can save them, um, use them that way, and then by the time they get that age, right. um, they can sell it and someone else can actually get good use out of it before they're too old right. to actually compete. Yes. Or, or work, so. Um, and all these ranches separate their horses based by the ranch. Mm -hmm. So, um, he's off Beg's ranch, and Mason's getting one off the pitchfork. So we can go over here and pick up his horse. All right. And then we'll go load him. And this horse's uh, bloodlines have much to do with the uh, with purchase. With the purchase, yes. Uh, well, he's really good. He's out of a height of flow uh, on the top side, uh, so he, he's got good ranch breeding. But they're good enough to compete with still. Okay. Um, and they they just make good cowy horses that are want to sit down in the dirt for you. Right. So stay, stay and you've got pretty cow. good experience in working with horses. And, uh, well, I don't, I don't like to claim that I'm super experienced. Uh, right. I'm 20. So, uh, how are you? Good. I don't mean to interrupt you, but I train at some of them a lot. Thank you very much. I, I like him. He's real calm. <laughs> Please let me right. know how he does, because that's a good horse. Yes, sir. What's your name? L.J. Stoville. I'm Dawson. Good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yes, sir. Have a good day. Yeah, you bet. You too. We'll, we'll contact you through Jay. Yeah, please do. Please right. do. We're going to take off here.